Hello, teacher. Hi, good evening. Ooh, Squid Game. Did you watch that? Yes. Oh, have you finished watching it? Yes. Who's your favorite character? Mm, it's men. The man, the one who colored his hair red at the end? Mm, he has mm, short hair and, mm, and curly. Oh, has he got a daughter? The one who's got a daughter? Yes. Oh, the one who won the game? The game is very. Mm. <laughs> okay, it's not that good for kids, right. I think. Did you watch with an adult? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Great. Okay. So, okay. And today is our last day together. Mm -hmm. and after that, we won't see each other for a while, but hopefully someday, some soon, we'll see each other again. <laughs> and you promised me a video, so next time, can you send it to me next time? Yes. Yes, thank you. Yeah. Okay, and let's begin. Let's go to unit 4A, listening. We haven't finished that one yet. Okay, let me do the slideshow. We are going to the next page, not here. We have finished this task. We are in number four. Okay, how often yes. does Richard see Aunt Betty in the summer. How often? Okay. Look at the calendars. Look at A. How often is that? In when day. Aha. That is every Wednesdays, every Wednesdays, every yes. Wednesdays, Richard see Aunt Betty in the summer. How about B? How often is this? Mm. Every Saturdays and Sundays. Yes, or weekends. Very good. How about in C? Hmm, I um, think it's not that often. So, so C on Tuesday. On Tuesday. This is Saturday and Sunday in summer. Mm -hmm. How many days? How many days is that? Two days. Two. So we can say twice a month. Twice a month. Or two times a month. Okay. Now we know. Now let's listen to number four. Three. Now, she worked in the restaurant there about five years ago. But now she works at the theatre. In the shop there, she sells books and Please postcards. wait for a while. Four. How often does Richard see Aunt Betty in the summer? Do you often see your Aunt Betty? In the winter, we see her once a week. She comes up to our farm on Wednesdays for her milk. And in the summer? Only about once a month. Sometimes we stay with her for a weekend on the boat. Mm -hmm. so, uh, how often? Remember, it's in the summer, not in the winter. Uh, 
I would like to listen again. Okay, I would like to listen again. Do you often see your Aunt Betty? In the winter, we see her once a week. She comes up to our farm on Wednesdays for her milk. And in the summer? Only about once a month. Sometimes we stay with her for a weekend on the boat. Mm -hmm. So which one is the closest? Mm. Richard, she and Betty's. Mm. All days in weekend in the summer. Okay. So which one is that? B or C? She said about mm, a B. Mm -hmm. Let me repeat it. She, he said about once a month. Is there an option for once a month? No, no once a month. But he also yeah. said he sometimes stay there for the week. Yes, it's just, it's a C. It's C. Weekend, I mean. Weekend. So, if that is once a month, so maybe he stayed there until Sunday. So, it's C. <laughs> and it can't be A because um, in uh, which... Mm, season does Aunt Betty go to the farm or to visit Richard? How often? Mm, farm. Mm -hmm. How often in the winter? Mm, Richard see Aunt Betty's mm, all days in Wednesday in the winter. Yes, that's once a week. Once a week and every Wednesday. Richard sees. Richard sees Aunt Betty. Okay, number five. What do Richard and his sister do when they visit Aunt Betty? Mm. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> mm -hmm. Look, at... Is... <laughs> Look at A. What are they doing in A? In picture A. Mm. Richard and his sisters a drawing. Is a. Uh... Is actually a draw. Yes, drawing. They are drawing in the picture. How about B? What uh, what do they do in B? Mm, Richard and his sister are watching TV. Yes, are watching TV. And in C? The C is Richard and his sister are talking with their mother. Okay, it could be mom or it could be Aunt Betty. Okay, now let's listen to number five. Five. What do Richard and his sister do when they visit Aunt Betty? My sister and I love staying with Aunt Betty. It's very different from home. How is it different? Well, she hasn't got a TV, so we can't watch anything. What do you do then? Most of the time she just talks to us, about her travels usually. Sometimes she goes outside and paints a picture. Then she comes in and starts telling us stories again. <laughs> are they good stories? Yes, and sometimes the stories are very long, so we don't go to sleep until after midnight. Mm -hmm. Let's listen for one last time. TV. So we can't watch any... How is it different? Well, she hasn't got a TV, so we can't watch anything. What do you do then? 
Most of the time she just talks to us, about her travels usually. Sometimes she goes outside and paints a picture. Then she comes in and starts telling us stories again. <laughs> are they good stories? Yes, and sometimes the stories are very long, so we don't go to sleep until after midnight. OK. Mm -hmm. Now look again. It's about Richard and his sister. OK, what they do. And it's not about Aunt Betty. Has Aunt Betty got a TV? Hello, Nam. I can't hear you. Yes, I can. I has Aunt Betty got a TV? Mm. And Betty has got a TV and Richard and his sister watching TV, watch TV and on TV has many um, channel, if, different channel. Mm, are you sure? <laughs> okay, I think you need to listen again, dear. But first, let's look at A. Who loves painting? Richard and his mm, sister or Aunt Betty? They are paint mm, uh, trees. Oh, I mean who? Who loves painting? Do Richard and sister uh, Richard. or Aunt Betty? Okay, we are going to listen for last the last time. Listen if Aunt Betty has got a TV. Who and who loves painting? Okay, now let's listen. Sue and I love staying with Aunt Betty. It's very different from home. How is it different? Well, she hasn't got a TV. So we can't watch anything. Has Aunt Betty got a TV? Mm. Has many different animal. Has Aunt Betty got a TV? TV? Yes. What did uh, Richard say? Mm. The what? He said, Aunt Betty hasn't got a TV, and so we can't watch any TV show. So, yeah. Aunt Betty hasn't got a TV. That means, can they watch in Aunt Betty's house? Uh, she hasn't got a TV. Can they watch? Yes. There is no TV in Aunt Betty's house, so can Richard and his sister watch TV there? No. No. So let's cross out B. Now look at A. Okay, let's listen. Continue. What do you do then? Most of the time she just talks to us about her travels usually. Sometimes she goes outside and paints a picture. Then she comes in and starts telling us stories again. <laughs> are they good stories? Yes, and sometimes the stories are very long. So we don't go to sleep until after midnight. Who loves... Three. Who loves painting? Uh, and Patty. Yes, so that can't be Richard and his sister. It's not A. So what do they do when they visit Aunt Betty? Um, Aunt Betty stay a driver. Talks about? Um, 
talk about traveling. Yes, that is most of the time. So maybe sometimes she goes painting, but most of the time they talk to each other. So it's C. Okay, maybe you you just missed out. Hasn't hasn't got a TV. My aunt Betty hasn't got a TV. Hasn't. Hasn't. Yes. It sounds like has, but it isn't. Okay. Next. Last task for listening for A. It says listen and color. But first, tell me what do you see in the picture? Mm, I can see a, a plane, a, a cloud, a helicopter. Some clouds. Mm, and a helicopter. Very good. Uh, some birds. Can you see the birds? Yes. Some clouds. And some clouds. Yes. What else? How about the ones the people are flying? Do you uh, know this? What these are? These are I don't know. Uh -huh. parachutes. Parachutes. Yeah. Ooh, that's white. Should be red. Parachutes. But this one is not a parachute, dear. Look. This is not a parachute. This is a hot air balloon. Hot air balloon. Okay? Yeah. Parachutes. Hot air balloon. Okay. Um, if you don't want to color, maybe you just you can just say which one do we color and which color? Okay? Yes. Okay, let's listen to the example. Part five. Listen and look at the picture. There is one example. In the sky there are some clouds. Can you see them? Yes. Find the biggest cloud and colour it black. OK. Can you see the black cloud? This is an example. Now you listen and colour and draw. One. Now you're going to draw another cloud. Where shall I draw it? Between the plane and the helicopter. One cloud? Yes. Do we colour or, or do we draw? Mm, colour. Uh-huh. I'm sorry, no. Draw. Draw. What do we draw? Mm, a cloud. Cloud. Where do we put it? Between the plane and helicopter. Yes. Can you draw a cloud? I think I can. I can't. Okay. Oh, you can't? Okay. Let me see if I can do it for you. What color do you like? Mm. Oh. A blue. A blue. Blue one. Okay. Let me draw a blue. <laughs> okay. This is a cloud. <laughs> Next, yes. let's go to number two. Hurry, 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 what's number two? Two. How many birds can you see? Five. Yes. Now colour two of the birds orange and three of them grey. Two orange, three grey. That's right. What do we call her next? Mm, a bird. The birds. The birds. What color? 
Mm, orange. How many birds are we going to color orange? Mm, three. Mm -hmm. How about the rest? The rest of the birds. What color? Yes. <laughs> How many birds can you see? Five. Yes. Now color two of the birds orange and three of them grey. Two orange, three grey. That's right. Okay. How many? Two. Two birds. Color with the color. Mm, great. Great. Oh, I think it's okay, orange. Orange. Two birds, orange. Three birds, grey. Okay. Oh, no. Okay, maybe later. Next. Number three. Yes. Now. Oh, sorry. Three. If you look at the plane, you can see it has three windows. Yes. Now, draw another one. A fourth window on the plane. Yes. And colour it green. Green. OK. Do we colour or draw? Or draw. Draw. OK. What are we going to draw? Um, the window on the plane. A window on the plane. And shall we colour it too? Yes, that will do. What color do we pick? Mm, it's green. Green, okay. So you know the difference between the helicopter and, a, and an airplane. Good job. Next, number four. Okay, thank you for trying now. <laughs> Before. Four. Now find the three women in the picture. Right, I can see them. Can you see the woman who's nearest the plane? Nearest the plane, okay. Colour her clothes blue. All her clothes blue? That's right. Mm. It says, can you see three women? Yes. Which one do we colour? Mm. Agree. Oh, I mean, which one? There are the three. First, uh, the first The first one. one. Next to or near the... Not to the plane. Okay. Which color? What color do we mm. use? Green. Um, I think we're done with green. It's blue. <laughs> okay. Yes. <laughs> Number five, five, five. Now listen to part five again. Oh, it skipped number five. Okay, maybe we can skip that one too. Now let's go to unit 4C, speaking. Please wait for a moment. I will open the PowerPoint. It's already open, but it's just that I'm going to switch windows. Speaking, here you go. And here we will talk about differences between two pictures. We will tell a story. We will make a story based on the given pictures. You're good at that. And answer some questions. Question number one. When is your birthday? Mm, it's 29th mm, at 
October. Oh, 29th of October. What year? Mm. Two thousand. Two thousand and ten. Oh, so you will be twelve this year. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Have you ever seen a real rocket? Do you know what a rocket is? No. No. Mm. Let's find some pictures about of a rocket. Wait for a minute. Let's look at a picture of a rocket. Rocket ship. Mm -hmm. Did you see that? Ooh. Where do ra rockets travel? What do you think? Mm. Where do they go? Outer, outer world. Outer space. Other world could be. So you see, this is a rocket. So the question is, have you seen a real rocket? Yes. Yes? Where? Mm. Yes. I can't know that. Um, maybe just on TV? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. It's big. It is. Yes, I think so. Very. <laughs> Do you like to learn about the universe? Yes. Why do people send spaceship or rockets on the outer space? What do yes. they want? Why do what do they want to know? Do you have an idea? A letter. Um, about what? Send letter. Oh, send letter to whom? To the aliens? <laughs> do you believe in aliens? No. No, okay. Mm -hmm. Are air aliens real? Are there living things in the outer space? So maybe the people want to learn about that. So they are traveling to the universe. How about you? Do you like to learn about the universe? Mm, no. No, no. I, I don't. Mm -hmm. Like the different planets, the stars, the galaxies. It would be very amazing to travel on the outer space. Okay, next one. Find the differences. Look at the pictures and find what's not in the second picture. Go! Okay, I'm gonna give you the mm. The taxi, the car is blue, but in picture two, the car is yellow. Yes. Okay. Mm. In picture one, the three men, they there are. are three men, go to the spaceship. Oh, uh, rocket. what do they do then? What mm. are they? They fly out the world. Yes, they are astronauts. Yes. Astronauts. Okay. What else have you noticed? In the two, but in the two, they are. These are for the the afternoons. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's it. What else? In the one, um, the 
three trees is under S the R. Mm, R under the the mouth the mouth. Mm -hmm. What? I think they are near. They are near. Yes. But. But in the two, three, the three Tree? trees, uh. three trees are on the mountain. Mountains, yes, very far. Okay, what else? Oh, we missed we missed a detail with the car. Look on top of it. Oh uh, yes, on um, the car has. The there is there is a box mm -hmm. on, on the car, but in meter one, in meter two, there there's is isn't. okay. Next, mm. the the grain is softer than the girl, but in meter two, the Grain is taller than the girl. Oh, you mean the old I'm sorry, man? Sorry, the woman. The old man is shorter than the woman. Okay, the yes. old man. Okay, so if you are not related to someone, you are not in. You, they are not your relative. So a grandma. Is an old woman. A grandpa is an old man. Old man. Okay. You're right. The old man is shorter. Okay. What else? In between ones, um, the woman is a uh, three. A woman has got straight hair, but in between two, the girl and the woman is. is has got um, curly's hair. Okay. What tells? Um, the babies is holding the rocket. A toy rocket. Mm -hmm. Yes. But, but in picture two, the babies is holding a flag. Yes, okay. <laughs> Good job. <laughs> uh huh. There's more, more, more. Mm, two the girls are two girls. wearing two girls are wearing uh, are wearing red t shirts, but in big two two the girls two girls as Two girls are wearing, uh, are wearing green t-shirt. Okay, there's more. Oh wait, let me teach you something. When you are describing, or you are mentioning someone the second time. Example: the two girls. Are wearing red shirts. You said that. And then the next will be, but in picture two, sorry, wrong spelling. Picture two, they are. We replace two girls into a pronoun look the two girls they are they how about for the woman what do we put what is the pronoun for the woman he or she Mm -hmm. She. She. How about for the old man? What do we replace? Mm -hmm. 
he he okay remember that okay how about for the car car it it very good so you can do the same okay when you talk about something the second time around we replace it with a pronoun why so we don't say the same word again and again so it will sound better okay now let's try again on our next answer okay okay you may continue yes. here. Mm, the cameraman is talk for us on the right but in between two the cameraman is talking photos taking. on the left is taking yes mm -hmm. can you change the cameraman which pronoun do we use but in picture two mm, but in picture two the cameraman is talking taking on the touching on the left Oh, I mean pronoun for the cameraman, like woman, she, old man, he. What do we use for the cameraman? He or she? Mm, she. <gasps> he. I'm sorry, he. he. Yeah, okay, so let's do it again. The cameraman is taking mm. photos on the right on the right but right. in mixture two he's mm. is talking taking taking i'm sorry mm -hmm. on the left yes it sounds like this taking 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 yes perfect okay have you found more? Mm. Many people, Andre. Try people's is wearing. Uh, Andre um, are wearing. Are wearing the. What's that? Do you mm, remember the those shirt? Patterns? What yes. kind of shirt? Mm. Uh. Cross or stripes cross cross or cross stripes a cross <gasps> this is a cross do they look like this x a cross is an x yes look again okay this is a cross this is a cross or like this. This is a cross too. Okay. Mm, yes. These are stripes. Just like the zebra. Zebra has I got guess. stripes. So what do they have? It's striped. Striped. Striped shirts. Striped shirts. In picture one. Five In boys, ones, a five ma men are, are, wearing, are wearing striped shirts. Yes. Got. But in big tattoos, they, they are wearing. They are wearing um, the. They are wearing um, white shirts. Yes, they. Very good. Remember that. When you talk about something for the second time around, replace the noun into a pronoun. Okay. You missed one. There's one more. I think two. There are two more. Yeah. What time? Which one? Let me show you. Ah, the two, two girls are 
wearing. The two girls. The two girls. The two girls are wearing a short. Wearing shorts. Wearing shorts. But, but in the two, they are wearing, wearing skirts. Very good. There's one more. Mm. Look for the animals. Oh, the rabbit. Mm. Yes. Three the rabbit is is a mm, a a behind the stand, but in big tattoos, three the rabbit are on the sand. Okay, or maybe rocks. Oh, rocks. Okay, okay, we found them. Anything else? Have you found anything mm. else? No, no more. No more. Now let's go to the next task. <laughs> this is William and Emma. Look at them. Which class do they both attend to? Mm, a sugimi. Yes. Okay. And now let's find out about them okay let me see what task is this mm, the task is i'm going to ask some questions you tell me the answers okay yes what's william's teacher's name mm. answer in full sentence please yes William's teacher's name is Vicky. Very good. What day does he have lessons? Mm, he has lessons on Saturday. Very good. Has. What time do the lessons start? Mm, the lesson starts at half past nine. Very good. Are the lessons interesting or boring? Mm, the lessons is boring. Lessons. Lessons is a boring. Ah, because there are many lessons. Is the water cold? Mm, yes, they eat. Yes. It mm, is. Yes, it is. Okay, that's for William. William thinks that the water in the swimming pool is cold. How about for Emma? Okay, this is Emma. Look at Emma's hair. <laughs> Emma's hair. Okay, what's Emma's teacher's name? Mm, Emma's teacher's name is Nick. Okay, what day does she have lessons? Mm, she has lessons on Tuesday. On okay. Tuesday. Oh, Tuesday. So they go together because they are both on Tuesday. Oh, no, 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 no. William goes on Saturday. Okay. What time do the lessons start? Mm, the lessons starts on four o'clock. Again? The lessons start. Are start the lessons start, are start at four o'clock. The lessons start at four o'clock we don't need to put r there okay the lessons start at four o'clock are the lessons interesting or boring what does emma think mm, the lessons are boring actually are interesting interesting is the water cold for emma mm, so no, no it, is. it isn't. 
okay, our time is already up. So what have we learned today? So we learned how to find information when we listen. And we also talk about how to describe differences to change the subject into a pronoun when we talk about it the second time around. Do you have any questions? No. Okay. Um, do you have something to say before we say goodbye to each other? Mm, I can't think. Okay. Just tell me in the video, okay? Yes, I... Okay. Um, I what I... Remember. Thank you. So thank you so much for the time that we've been together. I think we've been together for more than six months i think for more than six months it's it has been a long time yes a long time uh -huh. i hope to see you again and i hope you do your best in your school okay your studies yes okay <laughs> thank you so much now and see you soon <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, teacher. Are they crying? <laughs> I will uh, miss no, you. I, I will miss Goodbye, you, baby. Teacher. Bye bye. <laughs> it's my brother. Oh, okay, he's teasing you. <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>